A police standoff ended peacefully early Thursday morning in Sioux Falls. According to our news partner, KDLT News, a man barricaded himself in an apartment building located on the corner of East 6th Street and Phillips Avenue. A mobile command office was set up most of the overnight hours near the apartment complex. We were called to an apartment at 100 West 6th Street early this morning. We had some neighbors that said a person was being loud and slamming doors inside that person's apartment. Um, the officers went, they, they recognized who this person was. There had been some information that he had threatened deputies in the past. And so we had uh, three officers show up. Uh, once they knocked on the door and announced who they were, uh, he initially came to the door, opened up the door, and then had a what they estimated was about an eight inch long butcher knife that he held and threatened the officers with it. Once he did that, he slammed the door and then went back inside his apartment. The officers were trying to get him to come out and were, well, really he didn't want any part of that, but eventually they ended up calling out the, uh, well, our SWAT team and the negotiators came out and uh, he was taken out of the apartment and, and arrested for three counts of assault on law enforcement. Doesn't sound like there was any other issues. I'm not sure why he was slamming the doors and making the noise to begin with, but obviously at midnight it was disruptive to one of his neighbors. His name, last name is Mendenwald, M-E-N, or I'm sorry, uh, M-E-D-E-N, Mendenwald, uh, W-A-L-D-T, M-E-D-E-N-W-A-L-D-T. First is Ronnie, R-O-N-N-I-E, Middle is Lee, L-E-E, -E, and he's 71. <clears throat> and so you, he's threatened deputies in the past? Yeah, I'm not sure what... Warrants or something? Uh, could, uh, it could have been anything. Um, yeah, maybe, maybe he was living out in the county and deputies had dealt with him before, but they had some information that he had threatened deputies in the past, and so I'm not sure if that was a warrant or, or a different type of call. Did he threaten the officers this morning? Yeah, once they opened the door, he had that knife and threatened the officers with the knife before it closed the door. So was it a verbal threat? Did he, you know, like hold the knife? I think it was the way he was holding it. Um, I don't think he, at that point, I don't think he said anything about doing anything with the knife. It was just holding the knife in that threatening manner. Uh, he never lunged or slashed at the officers? No. Is he in jail right now, Sam? Yes, he is. Um, and the, the doors he was slamming, were they just the interior doors of his own apartment? Yeah, I think they were. And was it just one neighbor that had called or multiple neighbors? Um, I, well, what I have here is just one. I okay. don't know if there was multiple calls. How long was he staying at this place? Uh, that I guess I don't know. I think he lives there. I don't know how long he's lived there, though. Jerry Damon.